Hey, you guys, how are you? Fire sign, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. I got the uh, the music of the high vibration love going on upstairs for the kitties. <laughs> They're like, oh, that sounds lovely. There's a ton of good stuff on YouTube. So if you ever have trouble sleeping, just look for the high frequency or high vibration music, binaural beats, all that good stuff. Okay. So fire sign, let's see what's going on for you. This is June 4th, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Like I said, it may or may not resonate for you. If it doesn't, it's just not your, um, just not your day. Okay. Um, this is not like a TV show. It's not sequential. The readings are not sequential. My intention is always what message needs to be put out there. Please bring me messages for the fire signs watching. Okay. If you were drawn here by the thumbnail or by the title, there's probably something in here for you. Okay. It's also not really about the date. I've been saying this recently. And I think it's important. Nine of cups. I just saw nine of cups. Uh, it's important to know that these are not, um, astrologically driven, like it's going to happen on June 4th. Right. So just know that. All right. Take a look at the titles. Go back a while. See what you see. Taurus ver uh, Hierophant here, something about a commitment. Um, could be dealing with a Virgo energy. This is you. This is you going inside, dealing with an earth sign. I feel like the situation is like, nope, no talking. Opportunity, page of swords. I feel like there, this person could reach, somebody could reach out to you. Somebody who's a potential partner here. Uh, here's what's coming toward you. Hanged man. Woo. That's some stuck energy, my friend. Um, what I'm going to say about this is new information. Somebody could be sending you new information and it could cause you to rethink this or look at this a little bit differently. The situation with this person differently, right? Ace of swords, two of pentacles, 10 of swords. I know you feel confused and um, betrayed. Um, I'm not necessarily saying that this information is good. <laughs> Because I feel like the truth that they are some of for some of you, the truth is that they have been juggling a, a couple of people and um, the situation is over. Uh, you can decide it's over for you um, and you have a lot more to choose from. This person might have been juggling more people than you think. All right. And you're just like, you know what? I mean. There's something here about the commitment underneath here. Six of Wands. I love the bottom of the deck here. Six of Cups. You are their uh, idea of a good soulmate or a good match, a good connection. You are definitely soulmates. Um, world. Wow. Strength. Leo energy here. So I feel like no matter what you choose to do, you're choosing it through this energy of what is good for me, what's healthy for me, what am I doing here uh, with this person, you're wanting commitment. I think they know that. They're not giving you what you want. And I feel like, I mean, we've said this a couple times, you're trying to get Chinese food from a, from a pizza place. And that person just doesn't have that in them. All right. You're wanting to do what's right for you. And I feel like you could be moving on from this person this person um, may not uh, have it in them to make commitments. And if they're married or something like that, then that's even weirder. You're just like, seriously, you don't want any commitments, but you're married or you were married or something like that. This person is um, done with commitment, you know, down with love, right? Like done with commitment. And that is a, like a betrayal for you. Okay. So, for some of you, they could be in commitment and you're not talking to them. There's most definitely you're dealing, you could be dealing with an earth sign or another fire sign and you're not talking to them. And the reason you're not talking to them is you don't have, um, you, uh, want to go inside. You really want commitment for yourself, wanting commitment for yourself, wanting to overcome this situation, move forward in something that's very healthy for you. Wheel world strength. Okay. This situation seems like it's, it could be over. All right. Ten of swords here. This is a, 
I mean, it's not so graceful because ten of swords, right? You're getting ten of swords. Yeah, that looks pretty ugly to me. Um, but the truth shows you the is clear that this person is not going to hanged man two of pentacles. Seriously, this person is not going to do anything differently. They're not moving off of where they are. They're just going to tell you the truth about that. Like if you've been wondering, um, that's upstairs. Decline. Okay. So um, I love that it's connected to my Mac. I just go decline, right? Because, yeah. <laughs> anyway. All right, fire sign. So um, I feel like what you're learning here, the information you're getting, I, this person could reach out like a text or something like that. Okay. They're reaching out. But the truth they're telling you is they're not going to really do anything differently. Okay? And for you, that's not an option. You're like confused by that. You have other options. You want to move forward into something that's healthier for you. Okay? Okay. All right. We're going to continue this. I'm going to look at this person. What is going on with this person? Um, Knight, <laughs> Knight of Wands. A little bit of player energy there. Let's see how this goes. Okay? Link is below. Um, for the extended June 4th fire sign. I'll see you on the other side.